Hola, welcome, Golden Empress Collection, and I'm glad that you're joining me. I decided to do a little meeting and a mini read for you. Right now, Ancestor Dex is saying drama and karma, right? And for whatever reason, with this Jupiter energy that's here, <laughs> somebody keeps going with the silent treatment, something like that. You know, like maybe you're expecting this text and it's just not coming. It's driving you nuts. It's driving you nuts. But somebody is holding their ground. Somebody is, you know, feeling happy and lovely and sexy because they are. You have Jasmine and Lavender here. That's what I'm saying. It's, it's all about the mental mind state that you carry. Somebody wants to know where you are. I don't know why they want to know where you're at. I don't know. Maybe that's what you're saying. Well, what do you want to know about me for? I thought that this was done and over. I thought we made this decision already. Right. Somebody coming in here. They definitely want to talk to you. But what's crazy is even though they want to talk to you, they're still not saying anything. Do me a favor. Hit the like button. OK, now wait, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you guys can get these when they come up, because this is a timeless reading. I already know they're not even saying anything when they come back around because it and, and what it seems like is that they're still offering you crumbs. They are literally offering you these crumbs and you are so ben like, I don't know. It's like they want to put you in a particular place. You don't think that this person is beneath you, but what they're offering is beneath you. I hope I said that correctly, right? What they're offering is beneath you. Give me energy on this honeysuckle, please. It looks sweet. I mean, this person is probably sweet on you. But things like this take time and it takes respect. You got to respect something about scorpionic energy. You just had the grandchildren come out, which is Aquarius energy too. So a text message, that hope and that wish about this text message, tell me this, or are you sending it? Are they sending it? Somebody's still offering crumbs. Tell me about these grandchildren here. So it's their hope that you, you'll let your guard down. That's what this says to me. They want you to let your guard down and work on forgiving them because what they are offering you does come from love. But I'm just, I'm not necessarily seeing you put your guard down. Okay. What is this? And it's, so somebody can't get over. Maybe there was someone here, someone made an offer. There was an attempt that was made to reconcile. Unexpected, something was completely unexpected, but it brought out the truth about how somebody was not quite right or somebody was not necessarily getting what it was that they wanted. I don't know, maybe somebody's like, I'm gonna work a little bit harder to make sure this happens for me. That's what I feel. It's a queen of wands. Someone could be pursuing a feminine or this is a feminine that is just saying, I know that God has my back and that they are going to consistently offer me blessings, but I also have to work. You know, I also have to put in the work to make sure that my life is happy. Um, there's, there are bad moments that happen in life, but those eventually end, right? There is some sort of an ending. It's like a final conversation. And I don't know if somebody wants that to be the final conversation. Okay. Somebody still wants to continue. Somebody wants to press their luck with whoever this is, with this queen of wands. It could be a Leo, um, definitely fire sign energy, Sagittarius or Aries. What is it about the Aries energy I'm picking up on? Is there something about the Aries energy or the Leo? Sagittarius actually. Fire sign energy is important because whatever I'm picking up on air, the, the energy itself is whatever decision that's getting ready to be made comes from wise, wise reflection. That's what I'm hearing. Wise reflection. Whatever this is, whatever was said, somebody taking a break to heal created a tower moment but it was the wise thing to do. Somebody needed to know if someone cared. Someone needed to know if they would continue to show. I don't know. Somebody felt like someone had a mask on or if someone did have a mask on, they're choosing to leave. The mask is off, whatever this is. And spirit is working this all out in your favor. I kind of like the way that your angels kind of stepped in. And I think it's because you actually are 
a very sweet person. Whoever you are, you just have this ability to see where others have needs and kind of offer that help and you offer that guidance. You have, you're in something about you being very well mannered, but also being like a yes, sir, no, sir, but don't do me type of energy. I don't know. Maybe you're mirroring whoever this is. Maybe you were too much like this person. That's weird. Something about a teacher that's supposed to be teaching someone healing here and somebody couldn't handle the judgment or the decision that was required to do that. Listen, if you were sent a teacher to teach you how to love yourself, stand strong so you can step into blessings and blessings and blessing for other people, if you ran from that, oh my gosh, or if they ran from that, they are really stuck in their head right now. They are at the crossroads with that. Oh, this is, I feel like it's they, you know, the drama that has been gone through. Some of you guys, yeah, some of you all, this person could be spying on you because of the conflict that you've gone through. There's possibly a third party that presented itself at some point and it really, oh, whoever the third party is, I'm just going to tell you now, they're a very nasty individual, okay? They feel rejected in this relationship and they want something creating conflict on purpose. Yeah, you have a tower moment here. Taurus energy, you also have Scorpio. Um, lots of Taurus energy here. Someone's spying, just really, really immature and saying, you know what, if this person is all messed up in the head, that's fine. If they could block your love from someone who truly cared about you, they would. Oh, they're, they're bringing other people into it. I'm hearing cousins. There's possibly even an auntie that is in the middle of whatever drama this is. Okay. I know a few, a few weeks ago on the weekly, the all signs, there was someone who was bringing family all into the mix. So family, yeah, I can see it. Mercury retrograde, Mercury retrograde, Libra, Mercury energy here, Libra again. And then you have this air, this, this vibration is what I'm going to call this a dramatic vibration, bringing some sort of karmic justice for people that weren't taking action when they were supposed to be people that were supposed to be stepping into healing, but instead chose to crumb. They see the detail. I'm telling you, they see the details now and the people that chose to be helpful are being rewarded. I'm telling you, especially if somebody tried to bring a third party relationship into this mix, the people that stayed loyal are being rewarded. This is someone coming back together with their lover. All right. If somebody tried to treat you like an option, oh baby, wait and watch what the universe manifests for you. You have the world card, the magician and Miss Ida. So the high priestess, and I think we just did a reading earlier that was live. Go catch it because the magician and the high priestess came out in that reading and it was the current love energy. Wow. I'm telling you, somebody is highly upset and confused at how this is all playing out for you. You are going to have everything it is that you want. I feel like you're going to be reuniting with the lover here very soon. That's because spirit is giving you something because you've worked so hard for it. You have worked so hard and you know what? You've actually protected the universe. You've actually sat with Mother Gaia and said, I respect you. I respect just the vibe of you, period. Whether you are a masculine or a feminine, just being a caring individual brings you this blessing of love. High Priestess Energy, you know it. You intuitively sense that this person is coming in here. And you know what? The devil is going to try to make you walk away from it. You've already invested in whatever this is and it's, it does trigger you. I know it triggers you, but that's because it's a soul mission meant for you to learn how to heal this person again, or somebody about you or whatever you are meant to teach one another. Yes, I promise. Somebody might run from this though. Somebody might run from this. It's unfortunate if they do. This is for you. Check the description box and make sure you check out the Etsy channel. Peace and elbow grease.